Hey everybody, it's Sky here. If you're new, welcome in. If you have been here before, welcome back. Um, I'm the owner of this channel. It's called Sky Zary, I guess, I don't know. I don't know about the rest of you, but I've been playing a lot of Animal Crossing New Horizons and a big aspect of this game is designing your town along with like placing buildings. You can also place custom designs on the ground and on, and on signs and stuff. So scoured the internet to find the top cottage core, fairy outfits, and um, kind of like the natural town vibe creators that make these awesome codes that I could. So I just wanted to share with you what I found. Disclaimer, the codes you are about to see and all the designs were not made by me. They were made by the creators and I'm gonna go ahead and place their creator codes in Twitters if I have them. So yeah, just a heads up. We are now in Animal Crossing New Horizons, yay. So as I make my way over to Able Sisters, you're gonna see some of the, oops, wrong way. You're gonna see some of the paths that I'm going to be showcasing. Um, this is my main path that I use. It's a cherry blossom petal path and there's some really cool wood plank ones and they're made by different artists such as this one as well. That's a different one. So let's go on in and I'll show you how to get these. So while we're waiting for it to load, um, I'm not gonna boot up the Sakura Path one, so I'm gonna flash it on the screen now. Ba -ba -ba. So it's gonna be over here. Here is a list of all of the custom design codes, or if you go to Chosie from Poppy Isles code at the top of the screen, you'll be able to access all of them um, in bulk. I'll give you a second to screenshot that if you want this path. What I'm gonna do is go back here to the code bank. What do you, I don't know what you would call this. Custom designs portal, there you go. I'm gonna go here and this is where you're, you're gonna be able to get all of the custom paths and stuff I'm gonna show you. In the first content creator that I'm gonna showcase that I found on Twitter is named Kanda. Here is her Twitter. She is a partner Twitch streamer, so definitely go check her out. I'm gonna leave her links below, but she makes some of the most incredible um, custom designs that I've seen in this entire game. Alrighty, I'm in the creator ID and you can type in 8, 5, 11, 9, oops, 4, 9, 7, and then 6, 7, four, eight. Okay, and then press plus, and then it'll search for all the custom designs from that code. And here you'll be able to see all of Kanda's paths. And they're really, really beautiful, really detailed. And it's really nice for like a cottagey, woodsy, uh, witchy vibe. You could also have like, I could see like some of these white paths being used in an islandy manner. But yeah, here they are and there's some stones. The main ones I use in my town personally, since I started the game pretty early and discovered her paths really early, I think these are some of the um, more um, earlier ones that she made, but along the way she made more and more advanced ones. As you can see, they get more and more detailed. So we got some, uh, a doily. If you like doilies, she has a doily. <laughs> I personally just downloaded this three leaf clover one, which is really cute. Um, I use the regular um, three leaf clover design that the game automatically gives you all over my town to fill space, but these are nice to switch it up. These I've seen the flowers that I'm hovering over. If you've ever seen these, a lot of people are using these on the stone path that comes with terraforming and you can place these over it as kind of like a frilly overlay and they look so nice. Kinda also has some outfits I personally haven't tried out the outfits, but they look pretty cute. So if you're into that, there we go. And I know Kanda also has a second town, I believe. Yes, with extra designs. But for now, I'm just going to leave it be and I'm going to flash some of her um, graphics that she has on the screen. So ta-da, here we go. Yeah. Woo. Woo. Why do I make YouTube videos? I don't know. But yeah, there's Kanda's designs over there. So if you're interested, definitely check out Twitch, Twitter, creator codes, all that. Alrighty, so the next two artists that I'm gonna be showcasing, I did not find on Twitter. I just have the content IDs. So the first one I'm gonna be showing you is this beautiful, watery, grassy path over here. I do not have it in my town, but I absolutely love it. And I definitely would if I had more slots. Nintendo, please. I ran out of slots already. So I'm gonna go ahead and just show you what the creator code is. Okay, if you type that in and press plus, you'll get to access this beautiful design as well as some other paths 
it looks like it looks like kind of Alice in Wonderlandy themed over here. But yeah, um, this fairyish flowery path is very beautiful. I'm gonna go ahead and show some of the creations that this person used um, to implement this path in their town, and I think it is just stunning. Literally, just such a stunning path. Um, I love it, I love it. So if you're interested, here there was the creator code. Just feel free to rewind the video if you missed it. But yeah, there it is. Alrighty, to spare you the time of watching me type in the code, I'm just gonna go ahead and show the paths over here. So I'm gonna show the main graphic that attracted me to this path that I also don't have space in my pockets for to put in my town. And I don't have this creator's Twitter. But here is the picture that I got drawn to and the creator code is right there. But yeah, it's just so cute. It looks like a little cottage with the black roses literally look so beautiful with it. The cedar pines. It's basically a very foresty path uh, that is super cute. As you can see, they have some stone. Oh, I did. I did. I did. I stole this one that I'm hovering over. It's four pieces and it makes one of those circles. If you've ever played Animal Crossing Game GameCube version, there's a bunch of dirt circles in your town. So I just freaking love it. So I took it for my town, but that's all I had space for. Some leaves over here. So yeah, these are some really cute paths you can use in your town. Um, ooh, and it looks like they also have the full dirt path one that you could probably combine with these top ones. So yeah, um, the main one that was in the picture is gonna be this path right here. The darker brown that's the one i fell in love with so yeah go ahead and definitely check out this creator if you're interested in this path the final creator that i'm going to be showcasing is named maria i'm going to go ahead and put the twitter handle right here blah, blah, blah. um i specifically really wanted to give this creator a shout out because of the multiple skin tones in each of the designs as you can see they're mostly dresses very floral um, there's some fairy-like ones, and they all are available in different skin tones because, thank God, I know a lot of this, um, the designs on Pinterest and stuff are all just one skin tone, but this one has multiple so that it's inclusive and you'll be able to get one of these dresses um, no matter what your Animal Crossing character looks like. So that is something I really appreciate and wanted to give a huge shout out to you. And plus, the dresses are freaking adorable. I typed in the creator code. It's Maris down below so you can see like way at the bottom of the screen the creator code and it's also in the pictures that i was showing and i'll also put them in the description for each of the creators i've been showcasing but yeah look at all of these dresses guys literally oh, so cute and i haven't tried on um a lot of these the main one i downloaded was the rose garden one because i love anything floral oh no no i'm a liar I'm a liar. It was the Rosebud Fairy. There you go. That is the one I downloaded because I just loved it. It's one of the graphics I was showing. Um, by the way, Maria also made those graphics. So yeah, definitely look at this creator code and try on some of these dresses because they are fantastic and adorable. Alrighty, thank you so much for stopping by and watching. Coconut and I, thank you so much for the support. And if you want to hang out with us more, I have a Twitch account and I stream. Um, I'm trying to do Mondays and Thursdays, but I stream a lot of Animal Crossing. So if you had fun with us, mostly just me actually, she wasn't in the video today, go ahead and give that a follow. And again, and thank you to all of the creators who are putting out this beautiful art for us Animal Crossing fanatics with beautiful towns now thanks to them if you are a creator and you want to show me your codes go ahead and paste it in the comments below I'd be definitely interested in checking out more oh my gosh coconut's so mad at me I'm gonna put her on my lap but yeah thank you again for stopping by and I hope this video helped you have a great one bye